In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to fix Batman Arkham Origins not launching. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm gonna show you some simple to follow steps that are going to help you identify any errors messing with the startup of the game and how to fix them. So, for this method that I'm going to show you, it is going to work if you own the game through Steam. To my knowledge, you should be able to find the game files that you need to change if you have the game outside of Steam as well, but I'm just going to assume that you have it here to make this process a whole lot easier. First, go over to the installation folder of the game. So, you will be able to find this installation folder when you visit your Steam apps folder. If you didn't modify this folder, from its default location, it is usually under the C drive, and you will be able to go to Program Files and then Steam. For me, it is on my secondary drive here. Regardless, just go over to where Batman Arkham Origins is installed. So, Steam Apps, Common, and then Batman Arkham Origins. Now, you will notice that I only have a single folder here. This is because I've, I created them now. I'm doing this video for demonstration pro purposes about the process that you have to take, but you are going to have a bunch of folders and files here. Just follow my steps, find the single player folder, and then find the BM game folder. Inside of BM game, there are going to be a bunch of these INI files. What you have to do is first right click this file, and then I recommend that you go ahead and you add it with notepad or that you open with notepad. So, for this first method, there's going to be a bunch of lines of code here. What you have to do is find this specific line, allow D3, D10, and allow D3, D11. This refers to how the game uses DirectX 10 and DirectX 11. So, all that you have to do first is try to set D10 to true and then D11 to false. Like I said, there are going to be a bunch of lines of code here, so you can simply press Ctrl and F and look for this specific line, like so. Now, once you are done with this, try running the game after you save this file. If it doesn't work, then you can move on to the second method. Just go over to the BM engine file and delete it completely. By deleting this file and running the game again, it is going to try to modify the files anew and you should be able to get in. I cannot guarantee that this is going to work forever. You might have to delete the BM engine INI file every single time that you run the game because of the problems that it has regarding DirectX 11, 10, and 9. But usually, this is going to be a permanent fix once you change the values to true and false accordingly. I hope I was able to help you on how to fix Batman Arkham Origins not launching. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.